what's up guys um it's intricate from the iron book um also known as jeremy um i'm here to actually create a vlog to update you guys on what's been going on and what's gonna come um i think this is i did because it's more personal and i wanted to interact with my players and my community in a more personal level because i've always been one for the community um so i have a list of things to say today but i'll try to make it as short as possible um, firstly, I'll kick off by saying that I'm truly sorry. I apologize for being, you know, MIA to the server, to my staff. Um, it's not intentional. Um, I just needed to find a balance and, you know, um, the server has always been an escape for me from real life and recently I've been trying to deal with what I've been avoiding. Um, takes a lot of courage. I don't expect any of you to understand it, but I just wanted to be honest and say that I've been coping with real life and stuff that I need to do as an, you know, a human being and take responsibility for my life. And with that being said, there was, uh, there were a lot of, um, things that I had to sacrifice and cut back. Um, I could choose between my own personal gaming time, because I, if you guys still do not know, I do play League of Legends. Um, but between playing League of Legends and working on the server priority wise, um, I have been choosing League of Legends as my pastime because I don't really have a lot of pastime, but when I do, I kind of want to relax and working on the server takes a huge deal of dedication and, um, work. Um, I know this isn't what you guys want to hear, but, you know, I'm just being frank. I'm, so that's that of my MIA, um, just, you know, nothing huge, nothing against the server, it's just, yeah, I just had to work. Um, and then now on to the next thing. Um, next thing would be, how's the server and, um, you know, what it should be in the future. Um, to be honest, I don't know what's the state of the survey, so I know it's kind of bad, um, because my staff has been telling me that it's bad, I need to do something about it, but, um, the thing is, um, this month itself, I have a lot of things going on, you can choose not to believe, but I do have exams, and more importantly, a lot of life things to take care of, life issues. Um, so there won't be any, any update until the 26th of June, which is my last final paper. Um, and also, um, I would, to be honest, I was thinking about taking on the server right now, right then, after making this vlog, but I'm going to keep it alive for one more month. Um, by the 26th, if I realize that I still can dedicate myself to the server, I don't care about the amount of players left, I don't care about... Um, because I know how much the server has been damaged in the subpopulation, and population is one of the biggest criteria to running a server, but I don't care about that because I know there's a handful of you that still supports me, still supports the network, me and my staff, and make things possible for us, and we can dedicate the server just to you guys, you know, um, you know, have some fun. The server can be empty most of the time, but, you know, some fun, like, peak hours, we could have some fun, but... I still haven't decided that. It's something I'd like to do for the community. Um, but I would decide at the end of the month and give you my final announcement. But I've decided for this month, I'm just going to keep it up for one more month. Um, obviously, we're paying a bit of our pockets, so it's fine. Um, you know, we're going to keep the server going for one more month, let you guys enjoy a bit more. Um, fortunately, things are going to remain stagnant for a bit. Um, the staff is trying as much as they can to help you out. Um, except me, because, yeah, life issues, um, and I truly apologize for that. Um, so that's the second thing about the future now. Um, third of all, it's, I want to give a shout out, like, this is not the end of the server, but it kind of is, I guess. So I just want to give a shout out to, um, people, CBP, Michelle, Simon, Jay, Josh, Nick, um, so many of you that I, if I don't mention you, it's not because I've forgotten you, but I remember in my heart, um, just want to thank you for making it so possible, you know, being there, you know, uh, entering Rachel from, uh, what's that face, some train guild, um, David, 
Um, yeah, Carlos from the Dark Knight when the server first started. All these WoW active guilds. Just want to thank you. Um, definitely, I want to thank um, the other German guilds, um, Pinoy guilds. I know you guys were there. You guys might not be enough active because of the WA times. Um, but I just want to thank you. I know you guys are there. Um, Pouring Face Guild. Um, to German. I, I couldn't remember your name, but yeah, there are a few German people. You guys owe me beer. I'm gonna collect it one day when I go to Germany. Um, thank you again for supporting the server. I just really want to know that. I just really want you guys to know that. Um, as you guys have read, it was a heartfelt, um, thread where I explain exactly what the server means to me. It has always been a childhood dream. I just want to say thank you very much for making it possible. Although we didn't reach far, maybe 300 players peak, we reached an actual real server and it has fulfilled my dream. And I just want to say thank you very much for making that dream possible. Um, thank you and thank you and thank you again. I can thank you guys enough um, for making it possible for me. Unfortunately, due to life issues, I really can't dedicate myself at this point. Um, yeah, so that's the third thing on my list. The fourth thing on my list is to tank my stuff. Um, I like to start off with Olive. Um, Olive, if you, some of you may know who she is, some of you may not, but I want to thank you for being there. I'm organizing all my social stuff. Um, being part of the Facebook team. Even though you are, you have retired from the staff list, I want to thank you and again and again. I like to top HGM, who has already also retired, for being one of the founders of the server, not the network, the server, one of the funders too. Where you know we we kind of pitch in to start a server because it requires a lump sum of money. I want to thank you. Um, although you don't really know much about the server because you know you're not really into our but I just want to thank you again for being there. Um, you know who you are. Um, appreciation, man. Um, I also like to give a shout out to the. Um, I don't know what his alias was. Um, also the other hit GM which um was retired from the uh, staff list really early. You know who you are. Although we had other differences, you know. It's just, you know, over the net, you know, there's nothing personal, it's strictly, you know, formality and respect to. Um, and then I'd like to touch on the new GMs, um, GM Blank and GM, what's the name, Lemon Drop. You guys know who you are, I'd like to thank you for your dedication, your time, your belief, and your motivation for just being part of the network and for just you know working in the server without any expectations thank you mm, next you know I like to thank one of the biggest 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 person that has contributed to the network and the server um, one of the biggest um, you guys should know her she's called HGM Mountain Dew she is amazing if you guys don't know her personally she's amazing she's such a brave strong woman um, all my respects to her. I feel truly guilty and sorry that I can't fulfill my promise to her. That means I'll keep the civil life as long as I can. Um, I really hope that I will return one day. Um, this is not a goodbye. This is just, you know, me being honest. Uh, I really hope I can resume the state where my schedule is free up, where I could actually dedicate some time to server. Instead of making it a phony server where, you know, it's just no update, so there's no point. I don't like to, you know, have players like that. It's just... Um, embarrassing and humiliating. Um, I just want to say thank you very much. You know who you are, um, Mountain Dew. I mean, just wow. I owe you so much, and you know we're still friends. You are one of the person that still is part of the R network. Maybe not the server, but you are in entirely in our, all our projects. So thank you again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And the next, but last but not least, the one person I owe, I trust with my life, I would take a bullet for, not in a, you know, Brookback Mountain way, but, yeah, GM Eodis, not enough recognition, Admin Eodis, my partner, 
the founder of our network, the owner of our network, uh, the owner of our network, um, the guy I trust with my life, the guy I call my brother. Um, yeah, this also known as Joseph. If you guys don't know, he's Joseph Ting. Um, man, dude. You have no idea how much I owe you. You have no idea how much respect I have for you. You have no idea how much trust I have in you. Um, as a partner, I failed you. I, I, and me, uh, but I just want you to know that you will always be there in my heart and, you know, you are still the R network and you and I both know we have other projects to tackle when I have the time. Not when I have the time, but when I finally deal with my, take responsibility for my real life stuff. Um, which is this month. We'll definitely talk more. But, you know, as an official recognition, I just want to tell you, thank you very much, dude. I owe you everything. Um, yep. So that's four. And then the fifth is uh, about the future. Um, I don't really know what's going on with the server yet. Like I said, I'll leave it up for one more month and decide at the end of the month whether I can commit or, you know, to take it down. Um, if anyone's interested in picking up and administrating the R network, obviously there are certain criteria that we won't share. Like, um, we might sell you the server false or even give it to you if you're dedicated enough for free. Um, but if you are interested in running this server, um, mm, obviously you can use the R network name unless you know you work under us and administrate for us. Um, you can contact me or my partner at www. D dash r dash network dot net that's a contact us form contact we we'll read your mail we we'll reply to you with your qualifications um the server would be yours to run and you, you will own it because it's just a server it's not the r network we have different projects um the r network is currently working on a twitch streaming add-on for streamers that's one of our largest project which um, kind of started off, kicked off very, really well and then just kind of you know deteriorated because I didn't have the time but that's what my next aim is going to be to get that kicking and going for the R network that's the only project we ha currently have um, Project Deviant has failed unfortunately the higher rate you know wall server because I'm still really um, an amateur at networking so I don't really understand how latency works but like you most of you guys know I'm taking a course in my university about you know, software engineering and that includes networking and when I study more about understanding how networking works and I can make sure that, you know, um, the server doesn't lag because I understand so much about networking then, maybe I'll host a um, super high rate, you know, just like maybe just one weekend where all the goods come here, whoa, and that's it. Just, you know, as a, you know, it's just a wish, you know, bucket this thing. Um, Yes, yeah, so about the R network, um, if the server do go down, I mean, sorry, if the server does go down, um, we will be migrating the forum into a community forum instead of dedicate the, the, uh, dedicating the community to just the RO forum because we still we have other people that's part of the R network, like the streamers, that also belong to the community and I want to create like a general community forum so that even though you guys are not playing on our servers anymore or you guys have nothing to do with the R network, you guys can still be part of our network and see our future projects and also, you know, suggest anything or, you know, it might be potential anybody could be a staff of our network and help us on our project, we don't know. Um, but yeah, that's what um, it's going to happen if we don't have a, you know, the server that goes down. Um, we might revive the server in the future, we don't know, but I don't want to make the same mistake by, you know, m making a server and not having the time for it, because I feel guilty and it eats me alive. Um, yeah, so that's fifth of my list, um, and sixth of my list is, that's about it, just the update. Um, sorry, it took 15 minutes of your time, but finally, you know, last but not least, I'd like to thank my staff, my players, my community. It has never been just about the survey, it's always been about the community. All of you all, I, I want to thank you for having my back. Um, I will always be the same person as I am, the crazy ass admin, and um, I, I'm not just the admin, I'm also your friend if you want to contact me any time, any day. Um, I'll reply if I have the time, you know where to reach me at www.drnetwork.net um, And I also like to thank Yodus, shout out to my staff, Yodus, Lemon, 
drops, um, Mountain Dew, Blank, all the stuff. Um, shout out to my players, shout out to my old players that I don't play on my server anymore, shout out to the current players and truly apologize to my current players and yeah man, um, just thank you for, you know, making a small boy's dream, like, you know, my, my dream as a kid come true, like, I feel so satisfied but guilty too, so thank you, thank you and um, just want to thank you again, like, I've said thank you a lot but that's only because I truly mean it, thank you. He said, uh, hopefully you hear from me by the end of this one. Thank you again. Intricate and, uh, yeah, I approve of this message.